Hulk Creek most of them expected. Important time is this. The most holy of bells shall be scatterleaped onto the device of doom and curses. Yes, yes. But I have studied the voice. Not, not, not for controlling Vortex. Ah. Finally, you see the truth. A different purpose it has. The fabric of reality was torn, and from the realm of ruin, the Skaven's horned god visited its creatures. Clever child, it whispered with the voice of a thousand screeching rats. The celestial event that weakened the Vortex was of Skaven design. A parody of the true comet. The Council of Thirteen were architects of this grand manipulation. They ordered the devious contraption built. Its task complete and fuel expended, the rocket fell back to the surface. When the wreckage was discovered, its purpose remained unclear until now. It was the catalyst to weaken the Vortex and goad the other races into action. Every ritual cast, the magic was stolen, absorbed into the Horned Rat's bell. Now soaked in ritual power, the bell will be placed in its great carriage, made by the claws of the Scribe's clan, and move to Ulthuan's heart. If it tolls 13 times, the Horned God shall emerge from the Vortex. But there is a cost. The sacrifice of an entire clan. The Horned God demands the Chosen are made ready. And your clan will be fed to him. <laughs> you betrayed this clan. No, no. This was Council's desire all along. <laughs> See, gift. A bell clapper given to me. And whichever clan has their blood spilt on it when the bell tolls will be sacrificed. <laughs> Tell your lord. Spill blood here. No, no! Tell him! Tell him! Tell him! Tell him! A council will stop ritual. Sent many clans. Grace the clan. Give their souls. Now we are horned rats favored. Yes, yes. 